To begin with, we will try to think about those of us who are here and not of those who aren't. And from there, we'll try to find a path to victory. It's clear that we are weakened compared to the team that got that took us this far. But on the other hand, we have to find that path and that perfect script to achieve this win. Well, everything, because they have a lot of physical and individual talent. I'm sure their ability to play one-on-one -on -one and find well-defended shots with a good percentage will be very important in tomorrow night's game. For certain, they lead the competition in offensive rebounds. Being able to lock down the defensive rebounds, especially with the injuries we have, will be one of the biggest subjects to pass if we want to win. I feel that my team has been preparing really well, that we are prepared for this event. We have worked really, really well in the last part of the season to play a good role. That gives me confidence to see them work, see how excited they are, and that the group is really working together gives me confidence. On the other hand, we are facing a great difficulty. Us, in these circumstances, with the injuries we have, we are not arriving badly. It is true that C.J. Wallace practically rejoined practice now. It is true that Victor Sada could not practice at his usual level due to his physical problems. It is true that Joe Inglis is not as accurate as he was due to his sprained ankle. Not to talk at all about Pete Michael and Nathan Juwai's absences. But even with that, I believe we arrive with options. For me, in these Final Four games, as always, rebounds, free throws, and three-point shots have a very important relevance. Without a doubt, they know about our problems to rebound and will attack us a lot for offensive rebounds. It is going to be very important and very difficult. On the other hand, like you just said, the injuries are in the same position and to the best rebounding small forward. It's not easy at all. They have to try to stay away from what a game like this means and just think about the game, about this moment, about the next action on the floor, and not about what it means. On paper, that's easy, but it is really difficult to put into practice. Well, this is some sort of difference, but it is true. We are under the EuroLeague format, many kilometers away from Spain, which makes everything very different. It is a EuroLeague semifinal. It is the highest level, maximum excitement. It is true that it is a Clásico, that for fans and everyone, the winning team comes out stronger and the losers weaken. But in the end, it is another step to get the title.